again. Thomas, who made the initial break, can he get the drive? Oh, thoroughly deserved for Henry Thomas. This is cool. It's opening up here, and he's going to score another. He's developing a happy scoring tries. The inside to the Glamour, the Glamour managed to get away. It's, it's awesome coming back, you know, it, it brings back a lot of memories. I can still remember first team guys like Ollie Barkley and Chris Malone coming down and doing sessions with us. You know, and they, they live in my memory now and are certainly some of my fondest rugby memories. I feel very privileged to be able to, to do that now as a player. I remember how much fun it used to have, even on cold, Tuesday, Wednesday, Sunday mornings, um, where you could have barely feel your fingers. You know, love, love winning, love playing rugby, but you know, playing rugby with your mates. And I could see that straight away as I, as I came in to see all these kids having, having, having a great time. Tom de Glanville comes on to make his premiership bow. So just in terms of you know the pathway from here on up for these lads, I guess it sort of starts with as they get to sort of 14, 15, the DPP comes about, and that's a big stepping stone for them in terms of a wider pool of players and being amongst good players and then developing through that you sort of move up into the early days of the academy under 15 and 16. Boys have sort of matured quite a bit by then and there's quite a big difference in maturity between players you play against. From then on up it's sort of 16s, 18s. It's a fairly long process all the way up but it's definitely worth it sticking in it because you have so much fun on the way as well. It's not just about you know, the rugby, it's about meeting lads that are like-minded and getting stuck in. Everybody has a different path into, into professional rugby. We, you know, Henry went away and played at Sale. I stayed here. You, know, you look at people like Rhys Priestland who, who went to university first. So there's, there's no correct way to do it. The right way is the one you find. That never giving up attitude and you'll find your way to the, to the top. The link I had to Bath through playing for Bath Minis was massive. I always enjoyed my time there. Even though I left when I was 18 to uh, go to Sale, I always envision myself coming back here at some point in my career. And the power that is needed to take on the champions and Henry Thomas is getting the slaps on the back. Yeah, I think the, the, the wreck has always been a special place since I was younger. You, you run out from that, from that tunnel and you kind of look around and, and think you know, one day you, you were in the stands supporting this. I mean, you always got to pinch yourself sometimes. As, as soon as I, I came to my first game I was like, I want to do that. I didn't actually think that I'd make it a reality so to be sat here now with over 100 caps is, is awesome and I, I don't get bored of it whenever I run out of the record, always look up and I smile to myself because I'm like, <laughs> I'm, I'm here, so yeah, it's, it's awesome and uh, I love it every time. With under some pressure and so much pressure that the interception try and a charge for the line for Chris Cook. Having local lads growing up, um, getting stuck in, uh, it gives them something to do, keeps them active as well and you know, builds relationships between parents on and off the pitch. Um, everyone gets stuck in and it's sort of a role to play minorly within the community in terms of the comings and goings of the pitch, sorting out post protectors for the parents and then from the kids' point of view just getting stuck in and playing and enjoying the game. Enjoy what you do, I'd say one of the big, biggest pieces of advice. If you're really serious about um, playing rugby to Whatever level can be continued is just just practice your skills. But I say number one thing is, is enjoying it at the same time. Make sure you play with guys you enjoy, enjoy playing with, and you know win or lose, you have a smile on your face. <laughs>